hardworking and dependable are the two words that come to mind first. Uh, she's she might as well be another coach. She's she set that bar high for our younger players, and and they're working very hard to reach it and exceed it. When I step on the field, I act and basically and play the way that I would want my teammates to play. If you make even some kind of small impact on someone for some kind of aspect of their life, you're doing a good job. She's the hardest worker in the off season. She's always out. Um, she trains with a, an actual club program that's national, so she's flying to New York to get extra time in. She's going to tournaments in California and Florida just to play, just to keep active, and to set a positive example for her teammates. It, yes, it's a lot, and it's a lot to balance all my schoolwork and all my AP classes and everything, but it really, if you do time management and you rely on your family and everything, then it's a lot easier than you think. Last year, uh, when I got here to PH, we ran a uh, leadership class. It was a 10-week course, and she was the only sophomore to step up and be involved. And she was one of the most active during that, that time that we were, we were training how to be a good teammate, how to be a leader on the field. And she really took a lot of those lessons to heart. It's really easy to be like, you know what, I'm going to slack on this one thing because I've got all these other things I need to do. But grit is when you work hard every single thing you do over a long period of time. And it just means the world in a leadership role because you're showing people how you can work hard and accomplish all that you can. It's what you want to see. It's what you hope for everyone. It's the most positive example you could hope for. And, and if I feel like if I praise that and if, if you as a network praises that, then other kids are going to understand that that's the way to do it. It's to work hard in and out of the classroom, to set good, high, achievable goals for yourself, and just not rest until you get it.